Hi there folks, Andrea Cox here with TheHealthyHaven.net and AlkalizeWithAndrea.com. I'm here in a different love room today. Uh, my It's super gloomy outside and my other love room, the lighting was just not going to work it. So I'm definitely going to pick up some lights. Um, I'm shooting more videos on my own nowadays instead of having a videographer shoot them. I just feel like it's more natural. It's more on the fly. It's more in flow. Uh, but I'll definitely, my recipe videos coming up, I'll have someone shooting them because I tried to do that the other day and that is like a disaster on your own. Uh, so I, I wanted to do this video about something that really, really um, kind of kind of hits home. It has to do with detox and I got a lovely email from a man um, who follows me on social media. His father has um, cancer. And first of all, I'd like to say, you know, I'm not a doctor. I, I don't claim to cure anything or anything like that. But it's just a suggestion. <clears throat> you know, he uh, said, you know, I'd like suggestions of alkaline recipes. You know, if someone has cancer, the first thing you want to do is get them juicing. You don't even need to be worrying about, about alkaline recipes at this point. You need to get them off the white everything. White flour, white sugar, white, 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 white. You need to get them off the meat. That's the first thing they do at Gerson. It's the first thing they do at Optimal Health Institute. They, it's, and look, the, the, the news just came out with that there's a link to meats and cancer. So I'm going to get them off the meat, I'm going to get them off the dairy, I'm going to get them off the white sugar and flour, and you want to get them juicing. Both Gerson Institute and OHI, been to both, um, spent three months at one, uh, they both get people juicing instantly. And, you know, there's some controversy on whether to uh, juice things like carrot juice, you know, because a lot of people say, you know, with cancer, no sugar, no sugar, no sugar. But Gerson Institute, which is renowned for, I mean, everyone that goes there, it's because they have cancer. Uh, they, they juice carrot juice. They are huge believers in carrot juice because of the vitamin A. So, you know, you want to really, um, you want to really think about that instead of like looking for alkaline recipes. And, you know, I shared that with him. And um, here's the thing, folks. Another thing that both of them believe in is cleansing the colon. And I'm working on a product that, um, you know, I already have my lower bowel balance that cleanses the colon, uh, but I'm also working on a product that will really cleanse your colon, and I'm really excited about that. So I just had a call about that today. Uh, but, yeah, so cleansing the colon, coffee enemas. Lola, stop! <laughs> coffee enemas and um, you know uh, garlic enemas are great because you know garlic kills yeast mold and fungus um, you know a lot of people say cancer is a fungus and um, I actually was laughed at once when I said that out loud and I believe that it's just what I believe I believe that um, cancer uh, it is it is hard for cancer to survive in an alkaline environment and I think that's why this gentleman was asking for alkaline recipes um, but the biggest thing is to get rid of white flour white sugar um, all the Lewis stop all the uh, you know processed foods uh, clean out your house of all cleaning chemicals any cosmetics you're wearing have to be natural. I wouldn't even wear even lip gloss if I had something like that going on. Um, you know, uh, the things, everything you put on your body, lotions, shampoos, conditioners, goes into your bloodstream within 15 minutes. Clean it up, folks. It's got to be natural. If I'm around someone that's even used shampoo that morning and I smell like sulfates or if I can, if someone has perfume on, I mean, I, I won't even, if people have perfume on, I'm like, you can't stay at my house. I'm sorry. I'm allergic, you know, and then I get into it later about why. But 
it really sets, it sets like an allergic reaction off in me that is unreal. And it's because I've cleaned myself up so much. Uh, but also, you know, I think the mind-body connection is huge. So meditation, yoga, if they're able, you know, and I, I will not say about chemo, not chemo, blah, 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 because I've never been in that position. And to be honest with you, I don't know what I would do. Uh, I do know, however, that I would be cleansing my colon even more than I already do. And I already do it a lot. <laughs> And I know at Gerson, um, they have them doing it several times a day. I know at uh, uh, OHI, they have them doing it at least once a day. So, you know, really look into that. Wheatgrass enemas, coffee enemas, make sure the coffee's organic, you know, um, uh, garlic enemas, things of that nature. Cleanse the colon and juice. Juice, people. Get the damn juicer. I have a juicer on my counter that was 100 bucks. You can do this. So my thoughts about it, be well. And clean that liver with coffee enemas. Bye-bye.